What up, YouTube family? How y'all doing? Thank you for being with me. Welcome to my show, My Two Cents with Chatty B. Appreciate y'all. Hope everybody's having a great, safe holiday weekend. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, subscribe to my channel. I appreciate y'all, man. Share this with other people. Give me a thumbs up. Give me some comments. Let's talk about some stuff. Appreciate y'all being with me. <clears throat> Today, we're just going to talk about uh, men's blazers. The simplicity of a men's blazer and what you can really do with it. Okay? I got a few examples of some men's blazers I can show you. But, you know, you can go into all kind of different uh, arenas and you can dress up a blazer or you can dress it down. Um, it depends on how you want to wear it, okay? All right, so men's blazers, um, let's start with summer. Um, for summer, I would say the best option for a men's blazer would be linen, okay? Linen or maybe something with a cotton blend with linen. Um, it's just, it'll be nice and cool. You can wear it to an outdoor event or indoor event. It depends on, you know, how you you choose to, to do that. But the most important part is picking the right fabric for the time of year. Now I have a men's blazer. I'm gonna show you. Um, I'm gonna show you. This is just a nice men's blazer. You know, really nice, slim fit, horseshoe lining. This is called an unconstructed blazer. Unconstructed, if you don't know what it means, it means where a lot of times they don't have a shoulder pad in there or it's like partially lined like this one, which is nice because it's light. I don't mean it's cheaper or more expensive um, it can be more expensive when you have a fully lined jacket, but a partially lined jacket like this is perfect for this time of year, honestly. Um, I prefer an uh, unconstructed blazer for this time of year. So this is just a nice plaid blazer, nice slim fit blazer. Try to get your clothes to fit you. You know, everybody can't get things custom made, but, you know, try to go with your slim fits and stuff like that. Tell it fit is pretty good too. Slim fit fits closer to the body than tell it fit. But a slim fit is nice because it's going to um, basically, you know, feed off your features. You know, it's going to feed off your features. You got a slim fit. It's going to be slim around here. You know, nice and slim in here. That's what you want when, you, when you're dealing with a blazer. Because the, the better your clothes look on you, the better it's going to look the better you're going to feel, you know? So you can start with a nice linen blazer like this. You can get them reasonably. It depends on where you're going, you know? Um, I buy a lot of stuff from places like eBay. Not a lot of stuff, but some of my stuff I buy from places like that. You can get stuff brand new, you know? Brand new stuff for cheap. Um, a nice linen blazer can cost you between $100 and $500. It all depends on what you want to spend, the brand, you know, the fabric, and stuff like that. So, um, just, I think every man needs a nice linen blazer for the summer. You can dress it up or down. I don't wear sneakers with my uh, blazers or my suits. That's just, that ain't how I roll. But if you want to do that, you could. Just make sure you're doing it right. Make sure it ain't athletic tennis shoes. You know, if it's like... Alexander McQueen's or something like that, or uh, some kind of a casual dressy dress, um, casual dress shoe, uh, not casual dress shoe, but a casual sneaker. You can do that. So remember that. But a nice linen blazer, you know, they come in white, any color, you know, these are nice to have, you know, get you, make sure. You got a nice pocket on it. Most of them have, have pockets on the insides of them and the outsides of them. A lot of times, they when you buy them brand new now, 
they sew the pockets up, don't be alarmed by that. That's just to keep the shape of it when they sending it to you. You can always take your little blade or something and cut that, but just make sure you don't cut the, your, your jacket, you know, to open that up so you can put a hanky in there, okay? Linen blazer, great for the summer and maybe spring. Then, you know, when you really, you know, this is more dressy though. This is um, a cashmere blazer. Camel colored, slim fit. I would model it for y'all, but um, I ain't gonna do that right now. This is nice stuff, man. This is a very nice material. This is gonna be more for your winter and your fall. But, and this is fully lined. Well, no, take that back. This is um, partially lined too, so this is unconstructed also. Nice, because, you know, in the winter time, this is gonna keep you warm. Cashmere is a very fine, beautiful fabric. I love it, you know, sweaters, uh, blazers, cashmere is the way to go, really. This is, I love this blazer. Actually, I haven't even worn it yet. Um, but this is nice, man. You go to cashmere, and I'm gonna show you a wool one too. This, you know, I can completely dress up with this one. Um, you know, uh, nice shoes, some nice kind of a dress shoes, nice belt and stuff like that. But get you a slim fit, man, okay? Slim fits is where it's at. It makes your body it, it just it just accentuates your body in all in all the ways, really. You can't go wrong with that. Or tailor to fit. Well, like I said, slim is gonna fit your body a little bit closer to the body than than um, a tailored fit would. And you can get these in a three button or two button and sometimes one button. This is a three button, if I am mistaken. Yeah, this is a three button that I have here. This is a beauty though, man. Cashmere. It's, it's not cheap though, you know. Cashmere, uh, anything it costs. It's just an expensive fabric <clears throat> to manufacture. Um, so, but if, if you find them, you know, like I say, a lot of times you can vintage shop. It's not wrong with vintage shopping. I do it, but you just gotta know where you go. Go to the high-end consignment shops and you can find nice stuff that's been barely worn or sometimes not even worn at all. Take it. Get it clean, it's like new. I got a nice, a fair amount of stuff that I bought from a high-end consignment shop that was barely used or either not worn at all. And it was like new when I bought it. I cleaned it, keep it right, hey, you are gonna be good. And that stuff will last forever, as long as you take care of it. Take care of it. You know, you ain't gotta always go out and spend a thousand on this, a thousand on that. If you want to and you got it like that player, do it. But I'm saying, you know, how you build a real wardrobe is you get little stuff by little. You add to it. You keep adding to it. You add to it. You add to it. And then you got you some stuff. Cashmere blazer. Beautiful. Got one more blazer to show y'all. This is my baby here. I got a lot of babies, but this one of my babies here. This is fully lined, uh, all Italian wool, fine wool. Every man need him a wool blazer and a wool suit. And by the way, you can wear wool in the summer, depends on if it's a wool blend. You know, like in this situation, this is like a fully wool sport jacket. So I wouldn't wear this unless it was kind of cool. You know, it's too hot to wear this, even though it's fully um, lined, as you can see. But this is a, a winter blazer. Um, and yeah, get you um, the basics on a blazer. I would say, you know, get your... If you like black, navy, brown, something like that, get one or two of those colors and try to get you something, you know, with a little bit more pizzazz to it, some checkers, 
some plaids. I got a whole lot of plaid and check it blazers. I just like <clears throat> the different looks of them and how I can change them into something else, you know? Um, yeah, this is a nice one, man. All wool, Italian. This is brand new, I ain't even wore it yet. This is a two button right here. Uh, beautiful blazer, man. Um, nice pair of jeans if you wanted to, chinos, some slacks, um, nice pair of shoes. You good to go, you know? Yeah. This is this this is this is what you need. So I would say, uh, you need you a nice little wool blazer, a linen blazer, and a nice little some cotton silk blend or something like that. You know, if you want to just start now, those are the three I suggest that you go with. <clears throat> because with that, you can kind of dress around that, put little stuff with that. That's a good route to go. Because I know a lot of guys got clothes, but they ain't got no real man stuff i call it real man clothes because I, I just think you know a real gentleman should be dressed especially when he goes somewhere when you really going somewhere you need to be dressed like a real gentleman being dressing like the man that you are so you got to have this kind of stuff i mean i got plenty of stuff man i got so much stuff that um i haven't even wore all the stuff that i got because i'm constantly buying you know i'm constantly buying I, i'm gonna run y'all through my closet one day and you can be like, dude, you got too much stuff. Maybe, but I got enough where I don't have to want for nothing. Anything I want for any kind of occasion or event, I can dig in my closet and I can get what I need out of my closet. You know, I got the dress shirts. I got a bunch of ties, bow ties. I got everything I need because I'm a dresser. So a dresser is already prepared. Like I tell you, I'm always ready, so I ain't gotta get ready. That's my motto. You hear anybody say that, I made, I made it up. I'm just kidding. But seriously, always have your stuff, man. You know, nice blazer. You know, put this on with some nice shoes, nice pair of slacks, nice pair of chinos, get you a nice tie, nice hanky. You ready to roll, man. Ready to roll and take them down. Hey, that's all I got today, man. I appreciate y'all tuning in with me. I appreciate you following me. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, subscribe to my channel. I appreciate that, man. If you have any comments, get at me like this content this video give me a thumbs up share this with other folks everybody have a great holiday weekend stay safe don't be doing crazy stuff out there you know shooting bottle rockets at people's um cars and stuff you know don't do that we're gonna be good right everybody be good take care of yourself stay blessed keep god first Deuces.